Hey guys, what is going on? Lucas here and welcome to the start of a new series where we'll just be discussing anything league related. We'll be discussing meta changes, patch changes, my thoughts on champions, tips and tricks, whatever. But I wanted to start off with a dramatic entrance with BAM. What you see on screen, replays are coming to League of Legends in the next patch. Not in the next patch, I should not have said that. It's coming out in the preseason of Season 7, which is really exciting. Riot released about a year ago and the Riot Please, their first Riot Please that they ever made that they were not going to be ever making replays that they're never going to introduce it just because there's so many issues and it wasn't a priority for them so they were never going to make it so now at the start of this season they realized that they really need to it even says in the article I'll bring it up on screen here that they had everything that they needed to do to make it replays a thing in League of Legends but they had to worry about backpacking and what that is or backpatching whatever and what that is is that they can't um, do that because a replay won't work once a new patch comes out so that was their biggest issue um, but they've just decided to go ahead and go with it and so here's how they're going to do it so what is going to happen is you can download a replay at the end of a game or in your match history and so what you'll be able to do is you'll use this download you'll be able to upload it um, no you'll be able to like you know turn it up on your computer and so what this will allow you to do is it's gonna be like in spectator mode like we already have so if you go to spectate a game or any other replay system that's in the game even even if it's not official by Riot, um, it'll be in spectator mode. And so what this will allow you to do is you can open it up and they have a timeline like you already see when you like open up in your match history or if you go on the League of Legends website for your match history and you look at the gold differential and you see that difference and you have the timeline of significant events like kills, tower destroyed, Baron Nasher, dragons destroyed, things like that. So that's the kind of timeline that you're going to use. So it'll allow you to find the cooler moments in the video already, which is really cool. The another really cool feature about this is that they're adding a built-in recording system. Now this is awesome because you don't even have to have a recording software on your computer to be able to share this to social medias. So how is that going to work, Lucas? How are you going to be able to record it in league and still share on social media? That's a good question. Riot announced that there you can automatically record these highlights using a built-in recording software and these highlights will download straight to a file on your hard drive and so from your hard drive you can open up these clips onto a browser and then you can share it from there so it's really really cool it's really really innovative and it's finally time that we've gotten replays that's been a thing that's been complained about for years in the League of Legends community and it's finally time that we got it it couldn't be more exciting there's a lot of season 7 changes coming um, for those of you who haven't been aware, um, just a couple days ago they announced like pink wards even being changed like their functionality. So I think it's really cool that Riot has been able to come out and say, hey, we're actually going to come through with this. Um, a year ago we said that we were going to back down and that we weren't going to be able to do it. But now we're going to do it. We're going to come out and do it out for you guys because we want to make sure that you have the best possible gaming experience going into the next season. So let me know what you guys think about this. I think it's really, really exciting, and I couldn't be happier that Riot finally is introducing this into the game. I think that this will allow for a lot more creative videos on YouTube, a lot more cooler clips that you might not ne necessarily see because you didn't have your record, you didn't have a recording up or things like that. I think it's really cool, and I'm really excited for what this holds. I'm excited to see what they'll also add to it um, because it's in the beginning stages and things like that. Um, so it'll be really excited once the preseason rolls around to see how it really all works like that so hopefully you guys enjoyed if you did be sure to leave a like rating on the video comment down below what you want me to talk about in my next um, video where I talk about different changes and everything like that I'll be down to discuss it um, in future episodes we'll be discussing more than one thing but for now I just wanted to talk about this replay system and get this video up for you guys because I think it's very significant anyway my name is Lucas I'll see you guys in the future peace out guys and see you guys later bye guys